In this video, I'm going to talk about intersection and union function within Microsoft Power Automate. Now, intersection function, it returns a collection that has common items across the mentioned collection. Now, the syntax for the intersection collection, uh, intersection is basically intersection and then you specify the collection within the bracket. Now, you can specify uh, multiple collections as you see over here. Uh, in this example, uh, I'm creating an array which has A, B and C element and, and another array which has A, B and D element. The intersection of this is uh, a common element between both this array. So the common element is A and B and that's why it returns A comma B in the form of an array. Now that's how intersection operates. Union. Union returns items that has all items from a specified collection basically it is used to remove the duplicate item from the collection now the syntax again it's similar to intersection so union collection one two collection n and uh, i'm creating an array which has a b c element and then another array which has a b d element so the union of this is uh, a b c the array of the first element and uh, the item which is missing in the first element so abc already exists ab already exists so we'll not pick ab and the d will be picked from here and that's why the resultant array with be a b c and d so uh, basically this is used to remove the duplicate elements uh, from the collection so as you see in this array the duplicate element are ab and that's why the ab has been removed from the resultant array so you don't see ab twice over here in the output so now uh, from a Venn diagram perspective, uh, assume that we have two uh, array. So uh, from intersection perspective, uh, it will pick up the value which is common between these two. Okay. Now uh, from uh, a union perspective, it will pick up the value from this two array uh, in the form of uh, say item which is present in the first array, item which is present in the second array, and the intersection value. Okay, so that's the difference between intersection and union. So let's look into uh, the live example. So here I have a power automatic flow which has uh, two array in it. So the first array has 70, 80, 90, 100, and 110. And the second array has 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Okay. So if I use a compose action over here, so this is the compose action. Now here in the compose action, uh, I can uh, write the function of say, first we'll do an intersection function and I will use these two arrays. So these two arrays are composed using a compose action. So I will pick up the dynamic content. Okay. So if I come here and if I pick array number two, comma, array number one output. Okay. Pick one item. So this is intersection. Okay. Now let me write this intersection. And we will make use of another compose action to provide union output okay so let me maximize this yep add an action targeting this is union inputs union of dynamic content array to output comma array one output and save this and we'll test the flow so the flow has run successfully um, let me see the output so first array as you see the it has 70 80 90 100 110 array 2 has 30 40 50 60 70 intersection 
if you see 70 is the common element in it so that's why the intersection has resulted in 70 as an output whereas for union it will take all the element from array 1 array 2 and the intersection point so that is 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 and 110 so that's how you make use of uh, intersection and union in microsoft power automate thanks for watching